Welcome back to Carrots and Olives. It's Britt here, and today we are working in our Hobonichi wigs. I... <laughs> I am going to be setting up for the first week of September and the end of August. I am using paints today and a little bit of my stickers from my Etsy shop. And I am going to be drawing, as you can see, a leaf. I chose this image of a fall leaf because in my September Bujo, I did not do a traditional fall spread. So if you haven't seen that video, I will link it up in the i cards above. But because I like to dabble in multiple journals and multiple notebooks and multiple planners, I have the opportunity to try out different themes. And therefore, in this spread, I am painting the fall leaf. And this leaf is full of yellows, oranges, pinkish reddish colors, and some gold metallic colors. If you have noticed on the bottom left hand corner of the screen, I have included all of the paint colors that I use to make this vibrant fall leaf. I decided to add two, almost three layers of color to make this leaf as vibrant as possible on the Samoy River paper, and I think I succeeded. I also added the veins of the leaves and an outline around the leaf in the same color, and then adding a brown stem, and then going in with my metallic color paints. I don't know if you noticed, but I originally made the veins in the wrong direction. So I ended up trying to remove them with my mop brush and it actually worked. So you could see that they don't look all funky anymore and everything is flowing in the right direction. Once everything dried, I pulled out my stickers and I started laying down the ones that I needed to set reminders and appointments. I started off with the trash can sticker and the wash day stickers. I didn't like the trash cans actually being on there because I felt like it took away from the leaf. So I removed them and they peeled off very easily. Then I instead replaced it with the trash day words. I then added my weekly word stickers and continued to fill out everything for the following week. Okay, this is where it gets really frustrating. I was using my dip pen with the metallic colors and I just couldn't keep the paint to stay on the dip pen. So you could see here, I was giving it a try and really trying to work with it and then it just wasn't working. So I pulled out my watercolor brush to finish it off. 
and it says fall in love with moments. Well that completes my spread. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye!